Believe it or not, these beautiful horses are a dime a dozen. And we take in horses mostly from the track, but sometimes local if they've um, suffered neglect and people aren't able to care for them. And we get them back in top shape and we adopt them out locally. Some of these horses need extreme medical attention. Others, are you not itchy? Come on. <laughs> just need some TLC. But when a horse is injured, they might take six months to a year to heal. So we need them to heal before they adopt out. It takes a Getting village of volunteers to care for them. They're amazing. They're they're medicinal. Uh, they immediately, you know, just make your heart warm. Rewarding work for one volunteer. It's even life saving, you might say. I had breast cancer four years ago. I would come out here and I feed and I'd hang out with these guys and do meditation with them, do yoga with them. Ika needed Chevy just as much as Chevy needed her. And I actually ended up adopting him. <laughs> For years, the rescue combated tough elements out in Golden Gate Estates. The barn was difficult to get to. Brush fires and hungry wildlife posed a deadly threat. And the brush fires, those pop up, and everybody's talking about since the hurricane, there might be a, a greater risk of fire. This week, the rescue is moving to a brand new facility in the middle of Naples, where these horses will be safe and accessible to the community. Really excited for everyone to come and help and, uh, you know, donate and support. You know, we're going to need a lot of support. 